Throughout 2022, lawmakers in Sacramento and Washington, D. C. set lofty goals, and laid out significant funds, in an effort to slow climate change and improve the environment. And Southern California already is benefiting from those efforts, with billions of dollars directed to install new electric vehicle charging stations, shore up water supplies, reduce wildfire risk and more. But this year Southern California also was particularly vulnerable to the effects of climate change, as drought, beach erosion, extreme heat and other challenges hit home. As the year winds down, here's a look back at how seven major environmental stories shaped Southern California in 2022. The mega drought that started in the West in the late 1990s spiked in 2022, leaving reservoirs at historic lows and triggering unprecedented water restrictions throughout Southern California. In April, the Metropolitan Water District of Southern California for the first time declared a water shortage emergency. Some 6 million people in parts of Los Angeles, Ventura and San Bernardino counties were affected, with most limited to watering outdoors just one or two days a week. Then, in September, nearly 4 million residents in LA County were asked to suspend all outdoor watering for 15 days during a heat wave while crews repaired a key pipeline. Other water agencies across the region have implemented their own restrictions. Local lakes, and the communities that depend on them, also have taken a hit. Big Bear Lake is now more than 17 feet below normal, while Lake Elsinore was closed this summer after experiencing toxic algae blooms in its warm, shallow waters. <laughs>